Thank you, Johnny. Hi, folks, and welcome. This is Jeopardy! This is Jeopardy! Please welcome our contestants. Ah. Player one. <laughs> player two. <laughs> player three. And now, here is the host of Jeopardy, Alex Trevec. Hey, Johnny. Thank you. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Here comes the Jeopardy round. The first round of play today has these categories for you. Baseball franchise shifts in the bookstore, math, compound words, the old country, and official state things. All right, let's get back into this. Player one has control of the board. You can point the Wii remote at the screen and press the A button to select a clue. In 1958, the Dodgers and this team moved west to California. It's player one. Use the Wii remote or press the corresponding direction on the plus control pad. And then press... <laughs> you got it. Select again. The Braves spent 82 seasons in Boston and more than 40 in Atlanta, with a 13-season stop in this city. Let's hear it, player one. Please pick again, player one. In 1955, the Philadelphia Athletics moved to this city, where they remained for 13 seasons. Yes, player one. Yes! Hey, you're right. Choose again, player one. After the 1960 season, the Washington Senators left the capital and headed west to this town. Okay, player one. Good. <laughs> player one, you pick again, please. In 1972, the new Washington Senators moved west and became this team. Let's hear it, player one. Right you are. You again, player one. Fever, 1793, depicts a teen struggle during the 1793 epidemic of this colorful fever in Philadelphia. Okay, player two. <laughs> that is cool. Yeah! Player two. Ahab's wife tells a whale of a tale about a character mentioned briefly in this classic novel. It's player one. Right. <laughs> player one, back to Hope Was Here is a book about a teen waitress at the Welcome Stairways Diner in this dairy state. Player one. Right. <laughs> Player one, back. Take a bite out of the Vampire Armand, the sixth book in her Vampire Chronicles. Yes, Player two. Woo That's it. You get to pick again. A secret code called New Shoe is pivotal to the plot of Snowflower and the Secret Fan set in this country. It's player one. Yeah, good. Choose again, player one. 66 plus 32. Player three. Yep. Select again. 
73 minus 14. Yes, player one. Good for you. Player one. 148 divided by 4. Okay, player one. Yes. We return to you, player one. It's the Daily Double. You are in first place. So, what's your wager? And the Daily Double Clue. 17 times 6. That puts you even further ahead. Player 1, you pick 23 plus 8, minus 16. Let's hear it, player 2. Right. Player 2, back to you for our next selection. This aromatic herb of the genus Nepeta will drive your feline crazy. Yes, player one. Good. You get to pick again. Swallowtail, Viceroy, and Monarch are types of this insect. It's player two. Yes. Please pick again, player two. If you've gone this, you might have said something extreme or fallen from the Queen Mary. Let's hear it, player two. That's correct. You again, player two. Looking for a needle in one of these is a metaphor for an impossible search. Okay, player three. Correct. Player three, back. In days of yore, women sometimes rode in this style, meaning both feet on the same flank of the horse. Player three? That is correct. Select again. Let's go to the clue crew for this next clue. Shown here on the upper right, it changed its name in 1935. Okay, player two. You are correct. You get to pick again. It was Siam until 1939. Player three? We return to you, player Until three. 1972, it was Ceylon. Let's hear it, player three. <laughs> That's right, way to go. Player three, back to you. It was the Khmer Republic from 1970 until 1975. It's player two. Correct. Please pick again, player. Two. Until 1975, it was the Malagasy Republic. Yes, player one. That's right, way to go. Player one, back to you for our next selection. It reigns as West Virginia's official state butterfly. It's player three. Yes! yes! Player three. When Virginia got a state one of these animals, the governor's office released a poem that mentioned Adam West. Player two. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Choose again, player two. Sounds scary, but Colorado's official state fish is the greenback cutthroat type of this. 
Let's hear it, player two. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you again, player two. The syringa, also known as the mock orange, is Idaho's official state this. Yes, player three. <laughs> That's correct. Let's have a look at the $1,000 clue. Appropriately, the official state cantata of Connecticut has this spicy name. Okay, player two. Good. Player three, you're going first in the double jeopardy round when we return. Clues are worth $400 to $2,000 in these categories. Ancient History, 2006. Movie Folk. Book Learning. Asian Countries. Ouch. And Retronyms. Player 3, you go first in this Double Jeopardy round. In February, he shot Harry Whittington, not his intended target. Yes, player one. Ooh. Good. <laughs> player one, Discovery, and this legendary space shuttle went aloft. Let's hear it, player two. That's it. Please pick again, player two. In November, an Andy Warhol work depicting this Asian leader sold for more than $17 million. Player two. <laughs> you got it. You get to pick again. This famous American passed away the day after Christmas at the age of 93. Okay, player one. Yep. Select again. <laughs> Answer. One of the Daily Double. You are in the lead right now. Please select your way. Okay, here is the clue. He led the French team to the finals of Soccer's World Cup, only to be ejected after headbutting an Italian player. Congratulations, you're still in first, player one. You again, player one. Rejected by USC Film School, this S in DreamWorks SKG now sits on the film school's board of counselors. It's player two. Right. Player two, back to Jerry Maguire was originally written for Tom, not Cruz, but him. Player three. Back. Ah. <laughs> Player three, back to you. He majored in journalism at Fordham before playing a newspaper reporter in the Pelican Brief. Okay, player three. That's correct. <laughs> Player three, pick again. This actor got his name by giving his mom a fetal kick while she viewed a Da Vinci work. Yes, Player two. <laughs> hey, you're right. <laughs> Choose again. Player two. To get orc war screams for The Lord of the Rings, this director put phonetic yells on a scoreboard for 25,000 cricket fans. It's player three. Correct. We return to you, player three.
Her Little Women appeared in 1868. A mere 127 years later, her A Long Fatal Love Chase arrived. Let's hear it, Player 3. That is correct. Player 3, you pick a... In addition to 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea, he wrote an 1887 story on the Civil War, North Against South. Player 2. That is correct. You get to pick again, Player 2. All animals are equal, but some animals are more equal than others in a 1945 book by this author. It's Player 2. Right. <laughs> Player 2. Pick again. In 1840, he hit a bumpo in the road and penned the Pathfinder. Let's hear it, Player 3. You are correct. Player 3, back to you. In 1863, this Russian wrote The Cossacks, a short novel based on his travels with the army. Yes, Player 2. Yeah, good. Player 2, back to you for our next selection. The world's largest blue coral reef is one of the natural treasures of this country's Ishigaki Island. Okay, player one. Good for you! Please pick again, player one. Kelly will present this clue. You'll find the palace seen here in this country's capital. Yes, player two. Right you are. Select again. Norodom Sihamoni assumed its throne in 2004. Let's hear it, player two. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you again, player In November two. of 1976, the United States vetoed this reunited country's admission to the UN. Okay, player one. Right. Choose again, player one. Dhaka is its capital. It's player two. That's correct. Player two, you pick again, please. The rheumatoid type of this is three times as common in women as in men. Player two. Good. We return to you, player When these two. are less than five minutes apart and last about a minute, you're in labor, and the fun is just beginning. Okay, player three. Right. <laughs> you get to pick again, player three, and I'll hand it off to Kelly. Look out! A symbol depicting waves, a skull and crossbones, and a person fleeing warn that a device is a source of this. Player three? <laughs> right you are. Player three, you pick again. Per the Major League Baseball injury report, Randy Johnson missed his last regular season start of 2006 due to back these. Yes, player two. <laughs> that is correct. Please pick again, player two. An amputee may suffer real pain from this ghostly type of limb. It's player three. That is correct. Player three, pick again. Retronyms were created by putting this word before coffee 
and gasoline. Let's hear it, player one. That's correct. You again, player one. As opposed to digital, it's the kind of watch with a face and hands. Player one. Good. <laughs> Player one, back to you. <laughs> Answer, the second daily double. And you're in the lead now. What are you going to wait? Here is your daily double clue. Merriam-Webster's example of a retronym is console this. That puts you even further ahead. Player one, back to you. Frank Mankiewicz, the coiner of the word retronym, says one of his favorites is to parent this. Okay, player one. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> and the $2,000 clue? The Washington Post called Live This a classic retronym. Let's hear it, player three. That's right, way to go. You all move on to Final Jeopardy, which will continue after these messages. So much depends on how you do in the Final Jeopardy category, which today is Midwest Topography. So what's your wager? Each direction on the plus control pad represents a different response. Press a direction to select an answer. Here's your final Jeopardy clue. This state has the largest sand dunes complex in the United States, just north of a river named for its flatness. Did you come up with the correct response? With that correct response, you will gain What did you put as your response? And that correct response will add What did you say? How much yeah! do you add to your total with that correct response? Woo! Congratulations, player <laughs> one. You're the winner. We'll see you next time.